Hello everyone, have you ever tried kangaroo meat? Let me know in the comments what you think about kangaroo farms in Australia. In today's video, we'll see the entire process, from the birth of millions of kangaroos to the final product of kangaroo meat. It starts with selecting healthy breeding stock. Experienced farmers carefully choose strong and disease-free kangaroos to ensure the birth of healthy joeys, baby kangaroo. After birth, the tiny, underdeveloped joey climbs into the mother's pouch, where it continues to grow and develop. The pouch provides warmth and essential nutrients for the joey's early stages of life. It stays in the pouch for around six to eight months, gradually gaining strength and independence. During this time, the mother kangaroo provides constant care cleaning the pouch and adjusting her milk's composition to meet the joey's changing nutritional needs. Did you know that a female kangaroo can give birth to one joey at a time with a gestation period of about 30 days? As the joey grows and becomes more independent, it starts spending time outside the pouch. At this stage, it learns to hop and interact with other kangaroos. The joey's initial explorations are closely monitored by its mother and the rest of the herd. Ensuring it stays protected from potential threats and learns essential survival skills. Gradually, the joey becomes proficient in hopping and foraging. Gaining confidence to navigate the vast and diverse landscapes of the kangaroo farm. Around eight to 10 months old, the joey is weaned off its mother's milk and starts grazing on grass and vegetation. The transition from milk to solid food is vital for its growth and development into a healthy adult kangaroo. During this period, the joey begins to sample various plants. Guided by its mother and the herd, learning to identify nutritious food sources. Around 18 months to three years old, kangaroos reach sexual maturity. Males display dominance behavior, such as boxing to establish their position in the herd's social hierarchy. This stage is important for natural breeding and the continuation of the kangaroo population. As young adult kangaroos, they embark on a new phase of their lives. Where courtship rituals and mating dances take center stage. Kangaroo farmers practice responsible breeding to ensure the overall health and well-being of the kangaroo population. Controlled breeding helps maintain a sustainable population while preventing overpopulation and resource depletion. Farmers use their knowledge of the herd's dynamics and genetic diversity to strategically pair kangaroos maximizing the chances of producing healthy offspring.
Regular monitoring and health care are important to detect and prevent diseases. Farmers work closely with veterinarians to ensure the kangaroo's well-being, providing timely vaccinations and medical attention if necessary. The health checks include assessing body conditions, checking for signs of parasites, and monitoring overall behavior. Early detection of health issues allows for timely intervention, safeguarding the kangaroo's quality of life, and contributing to a thriving and healthy kangaroo population. Humane slaughter is a critical aspect of kangaroo farming. Farmers follow strict guidelines to ensure a quick and painless end for the kangaroos. Prioritizing animal welfare and reducing stress during the process. Modern processing facilities are designed with advanced technology and expert handling to ensure that the kangaroo's journey from farm to plate is done with the utmost respect and care. After slaughter, the kangaroo carcasses are carefully processed and inspected to ensure food safety and quality. Kangaroo meat is known for being lean, nutritious, and environmentally friendly. Expert butchers handle the meat, ensuring each cut meets strict industry standards and regulations before it is packed and distributed to consumers. Kangaroo meat is packed using sustainable and eco-friendly materials, minimizing its environmental impact. Responsible packaging aligns with the principles of ethical kangaroo farming. By using biodegradable and recyclable materials, farmers and suppliers contribute to a greener and more sustainable future, reducing plastic waste and its potential harm to the environment. Kangaroo meat is distributed to local butchers and supermarkets, making it available to consumers. Consumers can find kangaroo meat labeled with certification symbols like the Kangaroo Industry Code of Practice, indicating the product's adherence to strict ethical and quality standards. And finally, kangaroo meat makes its way to the plate. Kangaroo meat is incredibly versatile, suitable for a wide range of recipes, from savory stews to succulent steaks. Have you ever tried kangaroo meat? And if so, what did you think of its taste and texture? If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe and let me know in the comments what you want to see in the next video. Thank you for watching.